Hello. We're going to be working with compound inequalities, but this time we're going to work with the union, the word or. And I'll explain that when we're done. Right now, let's just work the problem. x plus 1 is greater than 3 or New word, new meaning. 1 minus x is greater than 2. So we solve, just like before, subtract negative 1 from both sides of the inequality on the left. Solve it, you get x is strictly greater than 2. On the right, subtract 1 from both sides you'll have negative x is greater than 1. Then divide both sides by negative 1. And we have to reverse the sign. We'll have x is strictly less than negative 1. Now just graph them. We'll graph x is less than negative 1 and x is greater than positive 2. and there is no overlap. However, we don't need it because we're using the word OR. Find the interval notation for each piece of the graph and our union is going to be the union of both interval notations. Now what does union mean? Union means everywhere where there's an arrow, everywhere where there's an individual solution set, that's part of the total solution set. That could be a little difficult to understand, but what we're talking about is every point to the left of negative 1 <clears throat> or every point to the right of 2, or both. That's what a union is.